What's up, nerds? It's Kashant again. Today, we're gonna go over two AI tools that's gonna make the web designers jump on a chair out of joy or go update their resume right away. Spoiler alert, it's gonna be both. Honestly, though, these tools should come with a warning label, and you're gonna find out soon why that's the case. All right, let's jump in. First up, we have figured our design. It's basically web design copycat on steroids. Watch this. When I go to figures explore section, I can search up literally any web or mobile app, like Gumroad, Airbnb, like any popular app you can imagine, or I can just search up for the page I'm trying to build. For example, a pricing page for a SaaS product. Once I like a design, I copy the file in Figma, and boom, figure spits out a pixel perfect Figma file faster than you can say the word plagiarism. And I know what you're thinking right now. Kashank, isn't this cheating? <laughs> Well, to that, some might say only if you get caught. But jokes aside, it's all about inspiration, so please be responsible or we'll have to stop doing these videos. And if you can't find the app or design in Figure, you can either use Web to Figma or HTML to Design, and it can literally copy any web page from the web and turn that into a pixel perfect Figma design as well. But wait, there's more. What if I tell you we can take this Figma design copy and turn it into a fully functional website faster than you can decide what to watch on Netflix tonight? And to chat our second AI tool. This bad boy takes your Figma design and implements it in the Wix Studio faster than you can say, I don't know how to code. It's like having a dev team in your pocket, minus the debate about tabs versus spaces. In your Figma file, we're going to use this plugin called Figma to Wix Studio, and then set up the export, which is basically copying the Figma file in a Wix project and selecting the frame you want to export. So when we go to the Wix here, we're just going to paste the link of the Figma file and then select the frame that we want to import into our Wix design. Depending on how large the size is, it's going to take 30 seconds to about a minute or two. And boom, here's our design. It looks pretty good. There's a bit of a text overlap in some places, and that's because like some of the font is missing. So when you update the font or you just change the font, size, it's going to all fix automatically, but you get the idea of how powerful this is. So basically with these two tools, you can go from, I like that website to I have that website in a time shorter than it takes to watch this video. Walk from it, run from it. This is the feature of web design. And now a word of caution. With great power comes great responsibilities. Just don't be the person who copies the design. Use these tools to learn, to iterate, to get inspired and be creative with your own creativity. So if you want more mind blowing tools, that's going to make you feel like you're living in the year 2050, smash that subscribe button. And also like this video, if this was useful. This is Kashank, your chief tools officer, signing off.